you know, alliteration, it's, it's dangerous. Uh, good morning, Harshman Vikings. What else do you ask? Yo, I'm the staff member who's really going to miss the students over Thanksgiving break, Mr. Reese. Okay, well, I'm the teacher who's going to really appreciate the time apart from each other, Mr. Hesser. Look, absence makes the heart grow fonder. Hey, today is Tuesday, November 23rd, 2021. And it's a white day. Today's lunch was prepared by Ratatouille himself. We have pasta with meatballs, pizza, and Italian grumbo, spicy chick fil a or the power pack. For side one, you can choose between grapes and strawberry applesauce. And for your second side, it's your choice between corn on a cob or a salad topped with. It's Indiana, which means the weather news is about as up to date as Miss Crown's grade book. It's time for Harshman Happenings. Students, remember that your break starts tomorrow, meaning you should not come to school tomorrow. Thursday, Friday, or Monday. Then on Tuesday, November 30th, we have a virtual asynchronous day, which means you will need to log on to complete your classwork, but you won't be reporting in person. The next time we will see you back in the building will be Wednesday, December 1st. Here at Harshman News, we make we want to make sure you learn something new every day. That's why we love Tuesday. Hello, I'm Cameron. Here's with your Trivia Tuesday question. What is the most commonly transplanted organ from living donors? Is it A, kidney, B, colon, C, stomach, D, gallbladder? And the answer is A, kidney. Over 20,000 people in the United States received a new kidney last year. The kidney filters about 150 quarts of blood every day. Don't say you didn't learn anything at school today. Now it's time for Before You Go, Stay in the Know. This Thursday is Thanksgiving, but the even more American holiday is Friday. Black Friday. There are a few theories as to its origins, but the one that has the most documented evidence takes us to the town of Philadelphia. Back in the 1950s, police in the city used the term to describe the chaos that ensued the day after Thanksgiving, when hordes of suburban shoppers flooded into the city in advance of the big Army-Navy football game held on that Saturday. Due to the extreme traffic and crowds, shoplifting became incredibly common on this day, and the police began to reference the day each year in their logs as Black Friday. After several years of frustration, retailers were able to reinvent the holiday. Now, in addition to Black Friday, we have Small Business Saturday and even Cyber Monday. Wow. Well, that's the news for now. Make it a terrific Tuesday. I got really aggressive. Terrific Tuesday.